I see we meet again. You have bunny questions, I have bunny answers. I have some pregnant bunnies right now, and I'm gonna tell you how I know that they are pregnant. If I mated them about a month ago, and I have one for sure that's about to give birth. In fact, it's either going to be today or the next couple of days. Normal gestation, the pregnancy time, is about 31 days. And uh, you're gonna wanna write your information down about it. This is what I did. This is the write in the rain paper. It's the all weather stuff. And I also have a pen that I bought. This was the cheapest one, that's why I got it. And it, it seems to work really good. So when it's cold, it still works. When I first weighed her, she was probably around 10 pounds. I just weighed her a second ago, and now she's at 11, uh, 11 pounds, two ounces. And it just so happens that I mated her about 31 days ago. When I picked her up, you could tell her belly and all this abdomen section was just very plump. It was uh, full. It didn't feel like bloat or anything, kind of like after Thanksgiving, you know? Let me show you what she's doing right now. She's already made her nest and has been hanging out in there for a while. I use this bedding material here and straw. I like it because I feel this is gonna give it a little bit more insulating characteristics. And I also throw some straw down just in case she wants to chew on it and make it herself. See inside of there. Notice her big belly when she hits the ground. Here's another one. This is my cookie bunny. Hey bun. You can also tell when they move. Um, if you pay attention to them enough, you can just tell when they have a lot of weight in the back end. They just move a, just a tad slower. You'd really just have to have enough bunnies to kind of understand, but this is the bedding. This is an example of what they normally do. So there's a little divot in there that goes down about an inch and a half or so. And the bunny mom pulled some fur, and maybe we can see a little bun in there. They have some fur on them now. They're probably about a week old. Uh, when they come out, they are pink. Kind of look like Vienna sausages. Look at it. Look how cute that is. And it's warm inside of there. Mmm. Nice 88 degrees. Oh, 90? Good. I'd be willing to bet it's even warmer than that. This temperature thing doesn't work very well. I'm going to go ahead and cover them up. So outside right now, it's probably 45 degrees. It's a bit chilly, my fingers are freezing, but those bunnies are gonna be just fine. Good bunny mom. Good job. Can I pet you? No? Okay. Here's the thing. If somebody tells you you don't need bunnies, then it's time to get some new friends. Hey bun, let me see you. Let me see you. You did a good job. All right. Let's cover these bad boys up. All right, look out, look out. I'm facing them, it's kind of breezy. Watch out, watch out. It's kind of breezy, so I'm gonna face them. Alrighty, I'm not gonna take your bunnies. It's kind of breezy, so I'm facing them away uh, from the outside here. I don't want that cold air to, to get to them. These, um, these boxes actually work pretty well. And I think I paid maybe around $14 for them or something. I got a couple of them. Whoa, whoa now, bunny. I tell you what, this one here is uh, hasn't been held too much. She's a little scary. She's actually one of the lightest ones we have. Eight pounds, six ounces. That's when she was pregnant. So she's probably a pound lighter than that, or maybe a little less. Look how nice she is. You see that? Look at this. Hey, what's up, bunny? You want to get back to your baby? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, what are you doing? What are you doing? She's like, I had enough. <laughs> she had enough of that. <laughs> um, let me tell you one thing. You see this big jacket? It's uh, really tough. It's great for not getting scratched up. 
So that's one plus about the cold weather. That's about the only plus sides of cold weather. By the way, when it's about 90 to 100 degrees outside, these bunnies do not like it at all. They will hyperventilate for, for all day. Um, you've got to make sure you have plenty of water. Uh, some people put fans on theirs. I have mine out of the sun. So here we are at the one that I don't think is pregnant. She has just a few more days before she's due to give birth. She hasn't gained any weight. 15 days ago, she weighed nine pounds and three ounces. Today, she weighs nine pounds and one ounce. Let me stick my cold hand on her belly. Don't move, it's okay. Yeah, I can push in. It's kind of like, you know, when you touch your stomach after never doing abs, it, it's kind of like that, yeah. The other pregnant bunny was plump. Yeah, there's no way for me to really show you and tell you, but I just, I don't think she's pregnant and it would probably be my fault. So I left, I left all of my bunnies in there except for a few of them for three fall offs. Now, if you know what a fall off is, it's when the male does his business and then, yeah, you know what I mean? Okay. Three fall offs. I'll tell you what I'm not going to do anymore. I, I'm not going to do that because that only takes about 20 minutes most of the time. Uh, I'm going to leave them in there either all day or all night. Now, a lot of people will say that you can't do that because the female will get tired of the male trying to do his business and then bite the junk off. Well, I uh, haven't had it happen. Um, and I don't plan on leaving them in there forever. Whoa, whoa, whoa now. Come on, be nice for the people. Okay, so, all right, all right. She's about to tear me up. She's about to tear me up. Here I am trying to show you how nice bunnies are when they're not nice. Quit, quit messing my mic. All right, quit, bunny. They're so soft and furry and warm and my hands are cold and she probably doesn't appreciate me putting my coldness on. All right, come on, come on, come on. Girl, get away from the mic. Make a lot of racket. I'm holding like a baby right now. Can you see this? They do not like being picked up. <laughs> if you pick them up enough and they get used to it, it's probably not a big deal. But as far as right now, she's not having it. But uh, if you like the video, do me a fave. Give me, give me a paw. Okay. All right. <laughs> okay. I thought we were friends. I give you all this food. Anyway, give me one of these, because I can't get a hug out of these. They won't give me a paw. I give them all the straw, leftover vegetables. Just stem my finger. She's like, I don't like ice. It's my fingers right now, it's so cold out here. Give me one of these, and I will see you in the next one. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs>